somewhere near Area 51. It seems to be windy out. <laughs> ah. I know I'm trying to get a hold of this. I can't. Ah. Okay. It's a little windy out. On the dry lake, a different area than I normally shoot, and it's awesome. And I'm on a little island. It's like where I'm going to be filming is on this little island out in the middle of the dry lake. So, fun times. Yay. <laughs> oh, I don't know which way I want my hair to go. It's kind of like I like it going that side. Is that like an 80s vibe or a 90s vibe? Like end of 80s, 90s? And then I like my lips like late, mid to late 90s when it's like the dark liner and the light inside. That's my favorite. I like the paler lip. That's just me. Some people like it better. I think I look horrible in red lipstick, but I don't know. Oh, I'm getting intruded upon. Well, hello. <laughs> ah. <laughs> the magical GoPro. <laughs> it just pops out of nowhere. <laughs> That's Gary's face. I'm not doing that because I'm making fun of myself because I have big teeth. Were you making fun of me? Okay. <laughs> I like to mess with him. He gets all weird. Like, why would you say that? And I'm like, I'm just kidding. Because my teeth really do go like, <sighs> I have these giant teeth. They're so big. They are. They're huge. Uh, and I'm a grinder. I don't know why. I have a theory about it. I could be completely wrong, but I could be right. I don't know if anybody would back me up on this. Okay. I started doing Botox in my, like, what was, what, 27 years old? So like around that time, you're like, I guess, late-ish <laughs> 20s. And I've done it for many years. And I noticed that after a few years, I started grinding. Now I'm wondering if it's because like your like your muscles get paralyzed, you know, from the Botox, that if it does something to where everything is more relaxed and whatnot, and that it just kind of stops that, that instead of me being able to, I can't raise my eyebrows, <laughs> that I grind my teeth. So that's my way of handling. Some people stress, make stress faces. I can't. So I'm wondering if it's the grinding of the teeth because if I do you know, stress out, I do it a lot at night. I do it in the day too, but at night especially. And here's the funny thing. I'm so normally like chill, no big deal. Like I don't try to stress, but I guess, you know, sometimes inside of us there's stuff. I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> so there's that. So I think that the Botox is causing the TMJ or part of, but yet they do use Botox to treat TM TMJ. Damn, I don't know. What if it's both? What if it's both? <laughs> okay, I'm done rambling. I know, I'm getting a... Hey, wait, look at that. It's my flip-flop. <laughs> oh, the wind stopped. Oh, man, I hope it kicks up again because that makes it really cool to do, like, hair flippy things. <laughs> okay, well, I am going to head on over to the little set that we created on the island on the dry lake. A moment with Gary. So the ground's not terribly hot because it's around 98 degrees at this point. It's not 100 degrees, thank God. So I'm just laying on the ground because whenever we're out on these dry lakes, you know, something about walking around barefoot, it feels so good. And then just laying on the ground, I don't know, you're just sort of... You know, I know it's a cliche, you're connected to the earth, all that and whatnot, but it's so true. You just feel so good. It's like every ounce of stress or whatever the hell you have going on that's a bunch of baloney, that's a distraction or whatever, all the noise just vanishes and damn, it feels good. I gotta spend more time laying on the ground like this. It's really something. I'll no doubt be dusty as hell when I get up, but who cares, honestly. So Tabitha is roaming around here somewhere and we're gonna start shooting a little vignette, a little uh, kind of pretty girl vignette sort of a thing for her fan sites. So uh, this should be fun, should be cool. There's some breezes that are kicking in. She's wearing kind of this sheer rope thing. 
that ought to flow around. I'm shooting in a little slow motion, not crazy slow motion, probably just 48 frames per second, just double uh, speed, double slow motion. Um, and uh, should look cool, should look really, really cool. We have great tools now in post-production, so if I want to slow it down even more, I can use some some of the uh, programs we have and even slow it down more and it'll look fantastic. So really exciting and damn it, I don't want to move. I just want to hang here all day. <laughs> it's so nice. <laughs> all right, I got to get back to work. Although for us, work is pretty much play, I guess. And we're really blessed that way and incredibly grateful. So, all right, back to it. A few hours later, the photo shoot. Later at 4.20. Yes, I finished shooting part one. Now I have to do part two, different outfit. Ah, uh, windy. <laughs> Gary's knocking stuff over. Oh. Are you getting good shots? I think so. I'm just talking. Oh, you're talking? Oh. Sorry. When am I not talking, Gary? <laughs> well, maybe when you're talking. That I've is quite said, a bit. I've said so many times you have the gift of gab. That's such a cliche, isn't it? Gift because, of gab. Yeah, but you have it too. I don't. I have the gift of gab. Here. What? Hello. Can we? I don't think we can hear. Oh, God. That wind, that microphone's getting whacked by the wind. I'll be so in shock if that microphone isn't just getting blasted by the wind. It looks good. A second ago, there was no wind. We might have to type that in the bottom part. Wait, this is, I'm having fun with this. Oh, the hair looks good though. Yeah, it's cool, right? It's like, yeah. It's like, hey Tab, what time is it? And I'm like, that time. <laughs> I should probably jump out of the shot. Nobody wants to see some what? old dude behind. Tab of the Steve. Uh, you know what? <laughs> I'm an older hey. lady. Oh! Hey, I'm real and I don't need the ego boost. So you, do, you do your thing, beauty. Gary, we're oldies but goodies. I'm just saying. <laughs> I don't look crazy, yes. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm switching this lens out. Okay. It's oiling in here. <laughs> it is. Somebody's laughing in a very funny way right now. I don't, who is that? Oh, I don't know. But I have a suspicion that there's festivities involved. There's always festivities involved here. <laughs> wow. I can totally tell. Hi. Hello. <laughs> I can totally tell by the, like the way you laugh. Really? It's, yeah. I can, I can tell Just by. The giggle. The state of mind, by the way, you laugh. I think I smell something. Something's... What's that smell? It's your butt. It's stinky. Did you fart? Oh, Tabitha, stinky. I am not stinky, it's you. <laughs> you just came in. Look at your hair and look at my hair. We're wind we blown. We've been, we've been filming out in this wind on this dry lake and it's brutal. Yes, and you lost your ponytail. Yeah. I did. You can have one of mine. I have one. I always bring one with me. Good because it's bring up the one. You can you can uh, you can open your window your door now, but uh, your audio is going to suck because the wind is going to hit that microphone. I know. So just so you know. I'm just checking in. It's weird. It's like this side of my face. What is that? My smile is so crooked. When I talk, it's crooked. It's like. I had to push. It happens. Some people have a crooked face. <laughs> ah, weird, I know. I always go that way. Even when I sleep, I sleep like this, like a vampire, and I turn my head that way. And I'll go that way because I wake myself up because I get a stiff neck. And I'm like, oh, so I'm like, no, go the other way. So I do it. But it's always that side. Even when I take photos, I like to go that side. Even though this ab looks better than that ab, what? like that side, it's true. 
No, it's not. Want to bet? Oh, Mine's more dominant gosh. in the way they're cut. Absolutely. Really? Absolutely. Oh, okay. I will show you. All right. I'm not making it. <laughs> because I see it when I'm doing my little side, guys, you know? You can see this side, the the right side's all like, it gets so ripped. I'm like, holy crap. And the left side, eh, it's there, but it's not where you can see everything. So. Hmm. All right. Oh, it's so sticky. I need to open this door. I want to open this door, but it's not that windy. Let's see. Is it windy? It's, it's not, not so too bad. bad. Oh, thank God. Actually, I can open this back one. It'll help oh. block it. Oof. Wow. <laughs> Doing? You're trying to mess with me. Get don't, out! Don't mind me. Just keep on talking. That's so weird. You're like of a square head. I know. It's because my my jaw is smashed into the seat. But you're lucky. See, I have to. I'm trying to get to some that. water out of the cooler back here. The cooler. It's bloody it's ass hot cooler? today. Cooler. Yeah. I know you wouldn't think it's windy. Got some clouds, and it's only like ninety something degrees. <laughs> So it's a lot cooler than it has been. Weird. All righty. Do you need a hair tie? I'm kind of used to it now. Okay. I like that scraggly look. Oh, my lips are so chopped. Look, it's so bad. Mm. Oh. I look like I've been herding cows or something. No, no, hey, where's the cows? We've got to get them to the corral. You know I what? have a terrible cowboy you're accent. You're so loud. Sorry. <laughs> I can't. Well, I'm talking loud so they can hear me. Okay. Uh, I have a horrible cowboy accent. I can try. I was born in Bakersfield, California. You'd think the Oki was was completely bred in there. You know what I mean? It's like in my DNA, but... I don't know. I don't know. I escaped when I was Bakersfield when I was a kid, so... I guess, you know I, didn't, I, guess I didn't get that You're part. being weird, because I think Bakersfield's fine. Okay, Bakersfield There's is fine. There's nothing wrong with it. There was nothing... We got teased a lot, because in California... Okay. So Explain. for those who didn't don't know, in California, a lot of people say Bakersfield is the armpit of California. Ew, you spit on that's what <laughs> that's what people would say to us, and it was really humiliating. And it didn't help was the fact that Oildale, yes, there is a city called Oildale right next to Bakersfield. <laughs> that's where my grandparents lived. And let me tell you, there's oil in them there hills. Yeah, Oildale, there's a reason to call it Oildale. And that was definitely some redneck <laughs> land. <laughs> there, but it's, it was nice. Like, it, it wasn't like... I, when I, no, all right, when you told me about this place that you grew up in, yes. I mean, I had never really been. So I'm thinking, oh my gosh, this must be really bad. <laughs> and we get there and there's suburbs and there's cute little places to, you know, No, there's and, not. Yes, there was. Did you know that at one point that Bakersfield... I think somebody's gonna have to fact check this. <laughs> At one point, Bakersfield had like the third worst air pollution in the entire United States. Hmm. It's because of all the agriculture and all the oil production. Uh -oh. And it all settles down in the San Joaquin Valley. And if the wind doesn't blow, it just stays the pollution. Yeah. I don't know if Ow. that's still the case, but for a while there, it wasn't so great. So. Anyway, look, I was born there. It's fine. It's cool. The people that are there are cool. I just, thankfully, I just escaped when I was a kid. This guy. He's crazy. He's crazy. <laughs> okay. I have no idea what's going on right now. <laughs> oh, wait. I have to get ready. That's right. Oh, okay. <laughs> Time for the sheer robe. Same shoes, though. I don't know. I might take them off. I don't know. I'll think about it. stuff in description. Go to Tabitha's fan sites. Tabitha is fun.